So, hope you enjoyed the shot sequence, a shot with my iPhone XR. All of the shots were manually focused and shot using a tripod. Now, because the built-in iPhone camera app does not support manual controls, I had to use the Filmic Legacy app to manually adjust camera settings such as exposure, focus, and white balance. Inside Filmic Legacy, I set the resolution in frame rate to 4K 25p with Filmic Extreme Bitrate and HEVC codec. This provided the best image quality possible from my iPhone XR. Next, I disabled the stabilization because the iPhone was on a tripod. Then in the film look menu, I selected log v2 for more post-production flexibility. It's not really necessary, but I personally enjoy color grading all of my footage. The white balance was mostly set to around 5300 Kelvin. In some cases, however, I used auto white balance and then locked it. Then for exposure and focusing, I used the white circle and square shapes on the screen. For the most part, I exposed for the highlights, so I would point the white circle to the brightest part of the image and tap on it to lock the exposure. When the white circle turns red, you know the exposure has been locked. The focusing process is similar to the exposure process. I would point the white square to the area I wanted to focus on, then tap to lock the focus. In terms of color grading, I simply increased the contrast with curves and adjusted the hue saturation and luminance of some colors with hue saturation curves. That's all I did. I didn't want to do too much because my iPhone is quite old and also it only shoots in 8-bit. So can a four-year-old iPhone XR shoot cinematic footage? In my opinion, it definitely can if you nail the composition, exposure, focus, and white balance. Of course, it would not be my first choice for shooting cinematic videos. As you may have noticed, some of the clips I showed you today had a lot of bending in the sky and noise in the shadows. However, if you're just starting out, you can learn a lot about filmmaking by just using your iPhone's camera or any smartphone camera for that matter. Stop making excuses, use what you have and just go out there and shoot. Thanks for watching.